Aloha friends, welcome back to a Simply Simple Life. I'm here to share with you guys a recipe that I often make the family. Um, this one has a variation of however you want to turn it to be. So this is a bread pudding. I'm going to turn it into Hawaiian style bread pudding this time. But um, there are times when I add like chocolate chips in here, white chocolate, or regular chocolate. The kids love that as well. Um, you can add raisins in here and nuts and raisins that goes together um, anyway kind of anyway the way you you would want to make it but the basic ingredient is going to be this and then add on or subtract from whatever you you would desire so for this particular version I like to use the King's Hawaiian original sweet rolls I have a 8 by 8 pan in here um, you can for this one bag you can use a larger pan, but I like to kind of mush my bread together. It just makes it a um, bit better for the, <laughs> uh, for the kids to kind of cut into. So for this particular one, I use a little over half of this. And then I basically just um, buttered up the 8 by 8 dish. And then I kind of halved it. Well, I halved it and then I squished it together so it's there nice and tight. And then you're going to have about 2 to 3 tablespoons of melted butter. You're going to drench that. You're going to um, drench it all over. And then you're going to um, be mixing these uh, pre mix. You're going to have four eggs. And then roughly about a cup and a half to two cups. Um, so start with a cup and a half, just depending on the size of your pan and how much bread you're using. You can use any bread. Um, day old bread is perfectly fine as well. Um, for this particular one, you can use half uh, whipping cream, half half and half or just the two cups milk as long as you have about one and a half cup to two cups of uh, milk liquid for this time i'm not using those i am using though um, evaporated milk for this particular recipe and then you're going to put in half a teaspoon of vanilla um, extract you're going to put um, cinnamon this is about a teaspoon and a half i like cinnamon on mine um, teaspoon and a half of cinnamon you can also add about um, maybe two, two tablespoons of honey as well, and then half a cup of uh, sugar. Since I am using evaporated milk in here, I reduce my sugar to just a quarter of a cup, okay? And then, like I said, this is the variation of like the Hawaiian, Hawaiian um, style bread pudding. I do have some frozen ube in here. Um, that I'm going to add on to the the recipe. Okay, so and then ube is basically um, Like ube halaya if you have ube halaya you can buy it in a jar Asian market or you can make your own I do have a recipe in here of making this particular um, This particular ube halaya. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started All right, let's go ahead and start drizzling our melted butter uh, this is about three tablespoon of melted butter that I'm just gonna drizzle onto there like really soak it in okay all right so while that is um, while the melted butter is on top of the um, the bread we're now gonna mix the the eggs the milk the cinnamon and then the sugar mixture all together you're gonna start off with whisking your eggs first and then gradually add in the other ingredients okay I started whisking the eggs I added the sugar and then also um, after a few um, whisking I added the honey that's gonna continue to whisk it until it's nice and smooth I'm gonna go ahead and add the cinnamon And then lastly, I'm going to go ahead and do the, the milk mixture, whatever your choice is. I've done it to where it's part cream, part half and half, like one cup, one cup ratio, um, a cup and a half or two cups of the just regular milk. And then like I said, for this one, um, I am using evaporated just because I don't have the, the regular milk version. And just slowly whisk it together until it's really well combined. I 
put actually another piece of bread in here and then what i like to do it's kind of hard with one hand is kind of poke it with a um with a fork so that the liquid mixture can just go right in i went ahead and also added um the vanilla and then while i'm prepping this up the oven is warming up 350 degrees okay so let's go ahead and add this slowly and you're just gonna pour it over make sure that it soaks right in this is actually a lot of liquid but it's gonna soak in nicely So believe it or not, I was actually able to fit three, three more of this uh, Hawaiian rolls in here. Uh, really nice and <laughs> really nice and cozy up in there. So, so it's really nice and compacted um, with um, the addition of the, the three um, rolls that I added in here. Now you're going to take your whatever extra flavoring. So this is the extra flavoring that I'm going to use today. So maybe the nuts or the, the chocolate, you know, like white chocolate chips, that's when you're going to add it on last. This one is my ube um, halaya, uh, ube jam also. And then I'm just going to kind of drizzle, get some of that, and then just add it in there. And that's just going to add extra flavoring onto like every bite. Doesn't have to be fancy, but you just got to make sure that you put it into the the spaces in between this is really good too with uh, with chocolate the kids love it with chocolate and already you can see the flavoring so it's gonna add, have it like a swirl color So I'm going to go ahead and put this into the preheated 350 uh, degrees oven for about 40 to 50 minutes. Just uh, make sure that um, you don't over, like over burn it, but make sure that um, you've um, cooked it thoroughly as well. All right, see you guys in a bit. Here is the finished product. It, um, I baked it for about 45 minutes and let it sit for about, I'd say 20 minutes. Now I'm going to cut into it. So if you like ube, this is a very, very delicious recipe. I'm going to spoon. Scooper. This is also good if you have it with a vanilla ice cream to the side. Oh my goodness, look at that. And remember that ube was already cooked. That ube jam. Cause see all the bread it's already dried so you know it's cooked okay all right so hubby's gonna take a taste test mm. Mm. oh my god good. good yeah i told him it's also good oh with goodness. like vanilla ice cream can i have this yeah, that's yours. <laughs> All right, friends. Thank you for visiting A Simply Simple Life with today's recipe, Hawaiian ube bread pudding. Very good. Mmm.